Hi, Gail Williams. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> so we're testing out a scale that we think we will begin carrying here. American Weight Scales Incorporated. At A-W- Seattle Coffee A-W- here. A-W-S. Mm. Yes. Um, and what's cool about the scale is you can just do your normal coffee, bean, you know, weight and that yeah. kind of stuff. But it also has a bunch of nutritional data in there. Yes. You can enter in, and it has a whole section in here for grains, dairy products, everything. And you can put in a particular fruits and You can put it in, and it'll give you the nutritional value of it. It gives you the carbs, the salt factor, fat, um, fiber, cholesterol, carb. I already said Uh, that. Protein. Protein. And calories, of course. And calories. Calories are up here. And And you you can switch between... Grams or fluid ounces. In ounces. Yep. So let's let's just show <laughs> let's just show if we put in uh, 052, which is Swiss cheese. Whoops. Oh. Hold on. 052. Okay. Now, if the if your hand no, let's see if the club was made of Swiss cheese, Gail. <laughs> <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> if the club was made of Swiss cheese. What? <laughs> Look at how, look at that, if if the club was made of Swiss well, cheese. Well, it's too wiggly. Because you're breathing and stuff. Anyway, you? you're, looking at, you're looking at over 600. Let's do this. We'll make it steady. There. Okay. So 40, 499, is that, for, is that set to grams Milliliters. Right now? It's milliliters. Let's oh. take it back to grams. There's grams. 17.8. No, oh, that's ounces. fluid ounces. Never mind. Grams. Okay. Yeah, 505 grams. It's got 1,333 milligrams of salt. <laughs> oh, man, protein, 144. Almost 2,000 calories. Look so at, if you ate fat. this whole thing made of cheese. Look at the cholesterol. 470. <laughs> you, would, and no, you would eat your daily allowance no, in this little tamper of cheese. No fiber. No fiber. <laughs> that cheese is going in and it's not coming out. <laughs> They should have the bind factor in here. <laughs> exactly. Um, okay. But anyway, so but so, you can also use this for something like weighing your beans if you exactly. want to get all scientific. Let's let's take this back to zero. And you know what you can do, Gail? They actually do have uh, coffee preparations in there too. So if you mm-hmm. weigh it for espresso versus mm-hmm. drip coffee, that kind of thing, it'll mm-hmm. give you things like that. It's coolio. Let's just do this. You want to put some beans on there? Yes, I do. So this is also a way if you aren't Four grains like of beans. crazy like us and want to find out different things as Swiss cheese, what their nutritional value is, <laughs> um, you can choose to weigh your beans yep. before you grind them to get very scientific, scientific about, about your Yeah, so now you dosing. take, of course, you know, your grinder's probably going to have a little bit of residual left in it, so that kind of... I would probably, if I really wanted to get exact about it, I would uh, weigh the portafilter on here. Oh, yeah. Zero it out, put the coffee in. Yeah, because you can tear this. Yes, so you, you can. can. Yeah, let's say you were let's say you were baking a cake. You can put the bowl on there, you can put the flour in and measure it, mm-hmm. and then take it back to zero. Like right now, I could take this back to zero. No, you got to hit the zero, not zero. clear. Now it's at zero, now so it's anything at zero. you add. Now I'm going to add some more beans, and it's going to tell me how much I've added. Four grams. I've doubled the beans. So you think you would go the route of tearing out the portafilter and then yes. uh, put the, put the ground weighing the ground it. coffee. That seems more accurate Versus to me. weighing the beans before ground. Well, I mean, it's one way to go. Somebody's going to probably say it's not the right way, but I know it seems yeah. like that's more accurate. I, th- I know there seems to be like different things where some people do, they weigh out the exact amount and then that's what they grind through their grinder. And maybe they've figured out that that's what works best yeah. for them. Well, one thing I have a question about with that technique would be um, the grind consistency, you know, because like when you, you start be having same. some... When you start to have some beans, just a little, a little bit of beans in these mm-hmm. grinders, they start bopping around, mm-hmm. and they're, mm-hmm. and it seems like they're not yeah. quite as consistent. Are you really getting it at all? So yeah. let's say we let's let's just dump these off of here. Let's put this on like this so that it's totally on there. Oh, okay. Zero. You got to clear it. Clear up here. Okay. okay. I zeroed it out for the. 
Okay, now you're going to zero, zero that out. Zero. Okay. Okay. Now, let's see if this is, let's see what the deal is. If I'm where I think I am, I should be, what is it on the triple? This is the triple. Yeah. It Remember? should be around 20-ish grams, I would okay. think. Okay, that's what, before tamping, so. Why is it at 14? 23, 23 grams. grams. And what did you say it should be? Yeah, around 20, yeah, 22, 20 to 22 or so, yeah. Yeah, so it's at 22 grams right now. Cool. That should be a good triple shot. Yeah. I All like, right. I, what I like about this scale is. Yes. It has a lot of functionality. You're not you wouldn't just be using it for coffee, you'd be using it for all kinds of things. Yeah. Cooking in the kitchen. I, me, I just go, mm, I don't measure it on a whole lot. I measure some stuff, but not to this level, but a lot of people do. Yeah. So it's multifunctional. So you could invest yeah. in a scale like this and, and not just use it for coffee, this but is for glass. other things. This as is well. all smooth for clean. It's really nice. Yeah. I like it. It's gorgeous. Look at it. I mean it could be sitting out and it wouldn't bother you. It's got a little battery in the back. Cool. Oh, that's a big fat battery. I wonder where you pick those up. I guess maybe. You I could think just I would purchase it. I wouldn't just pick it up and walk out with it. I don't like the idea. Might want to go to the actual <coughs> register. Yeah. Yeah. But anyway. Okay. Cool. Um, All right. Well, I I dig it, and we're gonna start carrying. Um, this style and something that's a little bit more simple too for people that just want a weight only don't yeah. care about this kind of data little, that kind of a thing a little less sophisticated yes which is fine we don't have the prices on this yet to even give a ballpark but yeah we'll, we'll get it but together. they'll be around and we'll they'll be up soon and but this is our first pass on this look at the web page thank you very much gal you're welcome